Good morning, RBG fam, fam. Welcome back to a brand new vlog. My name is Robert, aka ODM. My wifey, uh, I was gonna say my wifey Elijah, my wifey Vanessa is my high and my beautiful wife. My son Elijah and my daughter Layla make up the RBG fam. It is early in the morning. Matter of fact, right now it is about 5.30 a.m. Please hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you get notified every time we upload a brand new vlog. So we're starting off the morning, as I mentioned, it's 5.30 and I'm working from home. I am working from home because of the uh, current situation in the world, what's happening. I am being home isolated. Fortunately, I'm able to work from home and still you know, work on the radio station. So I'm gonna be hooking up right now, give you a little rundown of what's going on here at my home studio. However, my office is a mess, so don't judge me. In fact, you ain't even gonna get to see that part, but you will get to see my partners who are gonna be on FaceTime, Evelyn and Garrison, who's back at the radio station and we're plugging in in about 20 minutes or so. So yep, stay tuned and uh, we'll come to you in a little bit. So here we are, we're all set up. This is what I'm looking at. I got my laptop, I got my phone. Oh, look it. It's Evelyn Arrivas and Garrison King. <laughs> so we're gonna get through this day right now, this morning, and then we're gonna grab some breakfast and we'll see where the day goes. Maybe I'll get to jump from room to room. What's up, fam bam? All right, so I just got done with work. Just left the studio, which is literally five feet away. <laughs> and now I'm hungry, I gotta get something to eat. Wifey's actually upstairs right now. She's not feeling so good, so she's got a cough, a sore throat, and so, uh, and so forth. I'm gonna check on her really quick. Then I gotta get something to eat, I'm starving. Then I'm supposed to meet up with somebody to go pick up this uh, lens. I'm buying a lens from someone, so. It's one-on-one, -on -one, so we okay. It's not like it's more than 10 people I'm meeting with. So we'll check back with you in a few. Alright fam, so I just pulled up to this uh, parking lot right now. I'm about to go pick up this lens for my camera. This camera I'm actually on right now because it's a wide angle lens. I've been wanting it forever and a day. So uh, meeting the guy, there he is right there on offer up. So I'm gonna pick this lens up and then uh, we'll get the adapter ordered. And then hopefully within a couple days, we'll have the wide angle access. All right guys, just to show you the lens that I just picked up right now, this is the uh, Canon lens. It's got a wide angle zoom on it. However, I can't show you what it does because I don't have the adapter for it to fit on this camera right here. So that's why I'm here at the camera store to hopefully see if they do have one. The one I want on Amazon is only $43. I don't think that they have that one here. But hopefully they have something similar and it's almost close to the price. So let's go inside and check it out. All right, so I already got home. The wifey and I ate. She chose not to be on camera right now because she's really, really, really sick. At some point, we're going to put her on this video because she's part of the RBG family. You just don't want to see my face all blood. So right now I'm getting ready to go pick up Elijah at school. Babe, I'll be back. Love you. And also going to pick up um, Layla who's over at her grandma's house. Let's go to them right now. Look who it is. Miss Pinky. And there's Elijah. Elijah, how was school? Good. Who was all there? The teacher and me. That's it? No kids? No friends? Guys, so we know because of the whole coronavirus breakout, kids have, uh, well, Elijah doesn't go to a regular school. He goes to a house, just like these right around here. But uh, the teacher has about maybe eight to nine kids. So we were debating on if we should send him or not. He didn't go on Tuesday. I 
because he wasn't feeling well. But uh, we decided to let him go today. Now he tells me there was no other kids there, so that tells me that all the other parents are keeping their kids from home as well. So I don't know. I'm gonna have a talk with uh, Vanessa about this and see what she wants to do. It's kind of a sticky situation because I get it because that's how she makes her money. The teacher, we got to think of our family first. You know what I'm saying? We got to think of our health. Um, we'll see what Vanessa has to say when we get home. All right, guys, so we're back home now. And uh, let's go upstairs and see how the hyena's doing. Oh, hi. Hi. Oh, six feet, babe, six feet. I can virtually get. What's this? Look, I just got two feet. Oh, wait, What's this, guys? <laughs> now six feet. So tell the family how you're feeling today. I don't feel like super like body aches, but <laughs> my throat hurts really bad. And I keep coughing and I'm kind of getting a little worried. Um, but I don't have a fever, I don't have body aches. I have a little bit of a headache, so I took some Tylenol. But yeah, it's just like my chest just, I don't have any wheezing, but it's just very tight. And if I take a deep breath, I like cough, so. You know what sucks is that they don't want you to go to the doctors if you're sick. Yeah, I know, so we had our- Bye -bye. A, our uh, appointment today to go see uh, Dr. King. I'm gonna be 20 weeks next week, so it was kind of like my 20 week appointment, but I called and I was like, dude, I'm sick, I'm coughing. I'm pretty sure you guys don't want me there, and she's like, oh yeah, we don't. <laughs> so we so what are you supposed to do in that situation when you're at home and you need medication? You can't take medication, you're pregnant. Yeah. Like everything is just like. I'm just trying to monitor myself. If I feel to the point where I really can't breathe and I begin to have a fever, then I'll call. But right now, I mean, there's nothing they can really do for me. Right. I'm pregnant. I took Tylenol. I took some vitamin C. Did you tell them he was the only one in school today? Stop it! I did. I did. I felt so bad. I know. Hey, but that's better. Less kids, you know, you don't have to worry about Yeah, that's true. I didn't look at it that way. I was just telling them, like, maybe that's why the parents decided to pull out, too. Well, Thursday, it was packed with kids. And then today... Tuesday. Oh, no. Yeah, Tuesday. I'm sorry. And then this morning, there was a little girl that got dropped off. But I think she was new and she's younger. So she just went, like, half day, like, 11. So then after that, Elijah was by himself. Yeah. <laughs> We've been here at home. And I've been doing work out of the house, as you could tell, earlier this morning as we start the day. And that's just, it is what it is. We got enough food here. Thank God, God blessed us with food, shelter, water. you know, and water and everything else. And that's it, we got each other. I got a sick pregnant wife right now, and I'm just hoping that she gets better so that way we can just get past all of this and <coughs> hope for the best. And have this baby in August. Speaking of, you guys haven't seen the ultrasound. Yeah, so Recent. We, so we did her anatomy scan and she confirmed again it is a girl. <laughs> and there she is. Uh, this is probably maybe a good one or this I one? I like this one right here. This one. Turn it like sideways, like her mugshot. Her little arm is like kind of like right by her face. Ooh, you guys can see. Look at her hand. She's growing. I'll be 20 weeks on Sunday. Uh, I have to say, I'm a little nervous being pregnant around this time. Yeah, definitely. In, in the world right now. There's just so many people scary. that are pregnant right now too that are either having their babies now or... I know. I mean, look at all these YouTubers. Elsie. I think she's like doing? a couple weeks like ahead of me. Um, Savannah, I think she's like around the same as me. Right. I'm kind of glad I'm not due right now though. Yeah, I'm that's good. I'm kind of thankful that definitely. I'm not due now. It just sucks for the baby shower because I know we want to get that going. I know. I don't know what I'm gonna do about that, you guys. Mm. Lord Jesus, Lord, hear our prayer. What you got going over here, Pops? This truck is over there. Monster no, truck, no, let's go. No, this is the mommy daddy. Okay, go ahead. And then, then that's the baby over there. Oh, the baby's way over there? Yeah. All right, I'm all about playing trucks in the hallway. Get out of here. Exactly. <laughs> Coronavirus. Coronavirus. All right, fam, bam. So just uh, came to the end of the day right now. I just got out the shower. Finally, smell good, Aina? Woo! She can't smell <laughs> I'm gonna go grab another camera. <laughs> if I'm sick already, you got it already. So. Oh man. So man, the light, sorry. Excuse the lighting. Here. Hold on, hold on. It's because you like moved it, like didn't focus like great. But. Better, better. So we just got done watching Governor Newsom's speech today, presentation on the whole. At first, we thought it was like, I thought, because all the notifications yeah. were coming that LA was supposed to be on a 24 hour lockdown up until April 19th. It's 24 hour up to April 19th. 24 hour. <laughs> 
every day up until April 9th, people I'm trying to say, well, we just keep continuing to do what we're doing. Stay at home. Go to um, the website. It's in the description. It's all over YouTube. Um, you see it on every video. You can just click on it. It'll take you there. The do's and don'ts. People are not listening. People aren't listening. It's just not, it's not going to get any better. And I, I, I felt it in my heart. Like I literally was telling Robert, like when it kind of like first started, I'm like, this is going to get worse. This is real. It's going to get worse. And he's kind of like, eh, he's like back and forth. Because I'm, you know, you start reading things. When you get some time at home, you know, you start looking online and internet. You, you start kind of not believing, but you start putting things together and, and see if they make sense in your head. And then watching all these movies too. I know. <laughs> Contagion, but... Outbreak. We were watching Contagion or, or Outbreak the other night and I was literally getting like little like panic attacks. I'm like, I'm getting, like I had to calm myself down because I don't want to end up in the ER right now. It was scaring the crap out of me because I have to go to work. Like hospitals are open. Like I do have to work and I am terrified. I mean, where are they gonna do it? They're gonna place you, that, place you in a different uh, department, right? I don't know. Like I gotta do my job. I'm sure they're not gonna put you next to somebody who's like dying. If, if somebody comes in like potentially thinking that they could have this, I will obviously have my coworker probably go and attend to the patient. Just the fact that I am pregnant, I just, I don't want to catch that. And the fact that, I mean, you should even get a pass because you're pregnant. I Do you mean, know any pregnant women right now that are working in the medical field? Drop us a comment below because I, I can't, I can't see that. Yeah, let me know you guys. I'm still kind of really confused on what to do. I actually did call my doctor and the only way he can really put me out right now is if I was disabled and I'm not. So she's just like, do what you normally do, wear your protective gear, wash your hands, and keep them away. What everyone else is basically saying. There's about 19 people who have died in California alone from this, and almost a thousand people, a thousand cases. And that number's just growing. Yeah, that's what I told Robert. I was like, it's gonna grow. What did the governor say about 56% uh, of uh, California will probably have? Will probably have this, this in the next uh, eight weeks and, and weeks. I absolutely believe that like we were watching on um, pandemic on Netflix and they were going over the influenza in 1918 and just how quick that spread you guys they didn't have airplanes like we do like people transfer that on ships or walking right. like um, like our technology that we have now of transportation like flying and and what and RVs and everything like it's gonna spread even more like even faster that's so true pray for others pray for our families and you know what to do you know, what's crazy is that I have an elderly mom. I have an elderly mom who's at home, obviously, you know, she's 70 plus. And I'm checking on her every day because I know, I'm like, mom, you don't need to be up at Ross, you know what I'm saying? Go and get, 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 get spending your money so you don't lose it or whatever it is. I More believe it attacks anybody. everybody just by the fact that, you know, patients are dying like all age, all ages uh, or adults at least, but I am concerned Mama. with his mom. Like I told him, she Mommy. needs to stop going out. Mama. My mom's not going out to the club. It's nothing like that. <laughs> she's like, I mean, she's got to go for herself. That's why I told her, I go, I'll go to the grocery store for you. You know what I'm saying? Just let me know what you need. There's Instacart, whatnot. There's grocery stores that deliver. All right, guys. So just like we said, we're all in this together. We love you, fam, bam, and that's why we share this with you. But other than that, uh, it's getting crazy right here. See. I know. <laughs> Drop me another comment. Big like right now. You're going crazy with your kids right now. We want to give our post notification shout out, and that goes out to Elvia Limon. Hey, shout out to you. Thank you so much for watching our channel. We love you for that. I love me some Limon. You know what the coronitas? Not that corona, the coronitas. If you want to post notification shout out, all you got to do is one, subscribe to our YouTube channel, two, hit the little bell button so that every time we post, you guys will get notified. And when you're done, just comment down below. Hashtag, Hashtag done. Stay safe, fam bam. We love you. Bye.